As your skills develop as a DJ, you may want to think about upgrading your equipment. The first thing you can do is upgrade Serato DJ Intro to the full version of DJ. With this, you get the ability to record your mixes, you get studio quality effects from Isotope, and you can even download expansions from them as well. You also get four extra hot cues and three extra sample banks per deck. And on top of that, you can even mix video. To upgrade from DJ Intro to the full version of DJ, once you've opened Serato DJ Intro, on the bottom right you'll see Buy Serato DJ. Clicking that will open up your internet browser and take you straight to the page on serato.com where you can upgrade. You can also see a comparison chart where you can compare all the features between DJ Intro and DJ. So once you've upgraded that, you can download the new version and install it. Once you've upgraded to the full version of DJ, to access the extra four hot cues, if you press hot cue once, you've got hot cues from one to four. If you hold down shift and press hot cue again, hot cue will flash and you've got hot cues five through eight. To access the extra sample banks, if you press shift and sampler, sampler will flash and selecting pads one through four will select sample banks A, B, C and D. So the effects section on Serato DJ has been completely changed. There's now two different modes in how you use the effects. The first mode is the same as it was on Serato DJ Intro, where you have the choice between three different effects uh, controlled by one level depth parameter. The new way is having one effect but controlling three different parameters. In Serato DJ, we've now got single effects mode. And what that means is we can choose an effect, but we can affect different parameters of that one effect. So Echo, for example, We've got a dry wet control, we've got a reverse control that will reverse the echo, the feedback loop, loop on off, and a high pass filter cut off. So we can get a lot more out of just any, any effect at all. So rather than just having an echo and turning an echo on and off like in Serato DJ intro, we can now affect multiple parameters of that effect. To download more effects packs, click on setup, go into the effects tab, and then click on get more effects. Recording in Serato DJ is really easy. All you need to do is click record. You'll then see a record volume control and a record level meter. To start recording, just press record. You can then play your mix, and then once you're finished, press record again. All you need to do is enter the, the file name of the mix there, and then press save. And that's now saved that mix to your computer. So that was a quick look at upgrading from Serato DJ Intro to the full version of Serato DJ. In the next video we'll be going over upgrading your hardware to other versions in the DDJ range.